project in Texas is actually not IGCC. It's it's a okay. pulverized coal plant. Oh, it's pulverized coal. And so okay. you can think of it, it, it would burn a Powder River Basin coal. Right. And it's commercial scale, 800 megawatt boiler, 600 megawatts net uh, to the grid. It would service the Electric Reliability Council of Texas. And it would have a post-combustion capture uh, system, basically a scrubber for carbon dioxide that would capture up to 90% of the carbon dioxide from the facility. We're designing around 85 to 90% of capture. Through scrubber so this, technology. This would, this would be far and away the largest you know, proposal for a, a post-combustion capture system anywhere in the United States. It's located in Texas because of proximity to the world's largest market for carbon dioxide for use in enhanced oil recovery. So you, you know, introduce carbon dioxide, the oil comes up. Some of the carbon dioxide comes up with the oil, but it's can easily captured and then re-injected back into the oil formation. So at the end of the day, carbon dioxide remains in the ground and in oil reservoirs that have been stable geologically for millions of years. So there's every reason to believe that that uh, carbon dioxide would not go anywhere. And, and in fact, it would be difficult to extract uh, no matter what Even you if you course, tried to do it. Whatever you tried to do. That sounds like the kind of project that not only makes sense business-wise for a company like Tanaska, but also makes sense environmentally for not only the people in Texas for this country, but globally when you're talking about spending that kind of money to reduce CO2 and, and almost, you know, find another use for it, but get rid of 90%. Yeah, that's right. I mean, we think that the, uh, we don't know what the value to society is going to be in the future for removal of carbon dioxide. We think there will be value. We think there's going to be regulations that limit CO2 emissions from power plants. Uh, but there, there's a lot of uncertainty there. But if we can make use of the carbon dioxide, in this case, it just makes sense to us as a prudent thing to do.